Hey guys, Blood Moon Bobby here, and I am here at Long Beach Comic Con. I've met some amazing cosplayers from all kinds of franchises, and I even interviewed Ricky Simmons, the guy who played Gur from Invader Zim. So let's go check him out. The 2018 Long Beach Comic Con was held on September 8th and 9th at the Long Beach Convention Center. It's a con in the Los Angeles area that is considerably less crowded than Anime Expo. The convention is one of my favorite places to meet animation and video game fans. I went on September 9th and met some amazing Marco fans, as well as some great cosplayers of other cool characters. What do you like about Danny? I like how he's a 14 year old kid, like how Spider-Man is, except he's a ghost. He has ghost powers, he can fly, he can shoot lasers, and he's still a high school kid, so it's like, oh, I can relate to this guy when I first watched him. Um, what are your, some of your favorite Nickelodeon shows? Uh, Danny Phantom, Fairly Odd Parents. El Tigre, that was one my sister and I would love. The, that's a good one. Old classic SpongeBob. The newer ones, I'm kind of like, eh, they're whatever. And Rugrats, gotta go 90s. Rocko's Modern Life, Invader Zim, all of the old 90 cartoons my sister and I watched. Your favorite Star Wars character? Uh, Darth Maul is one, one of them, yes. But I've always kind of sort of liked the dark side, the bad guys, so on and so forth. They're a lot of fun. <laughs> Can you name some of your favorite dark side characters? Dark side characters? Oh, let's see. The Emperor is kind of cool. I like Darth Maul. Um, Darth Vader was cool, but he turned out to be a traitor. But yeah, that pretty much rounds out the list. I mean, General Grievous, I think, is overrated, but we won't go there. <laughs> and um, what do you think of the Star Wars cosplay you've seen at Long Beach Comic Con? Um, I love it. Uh, fantastic. I love everything from the costumes that were just put together last night to the ones where people have been working on them for better parts of a year or two. Any level of cosplay, is, as long as you're out here and you're enjoying the atmosphere and being part of this creative energy. Not only were there lots of cosplayers, but there was also a lot of merchandise. We couldn't find much Star vs. The Forces of Evil or Gravity Falls merch, but there were plenty of Funko figures, artwork, and derby shirts for other franchises. You like this Dark Souls Praise the Sun shirt my sister Penny bought? Actors, writers, and artists also held panels at the convention. We didn't go to any this year, but I had the pleasure of meeting Invader Zim actor Ricky Simmons at his booth. He is the voice of Gurr, the dim-witted but funny robot in the show. So how are you doing, Ricky? I'm okay, how are you? I'm doing great. So any progress on the Invader Zim Enter the Floorpus movie? Uh, I assume so. I, I'm, I'm just a voice actor on this one. Uh, on the original series, I was a voice actor and a background painter. So I've already done all the voice at over I'm going to do on this one. I'm, I'm not doing any color on, on this one. So I only get to see uh, pieces of it now and then if I go in and visit people. Um, but last I saw it looked pretty good. So, yeah. Can you tell us about what is the title, any information about what the title is? For the you know, honestly, I don't remember a florpus in the script. I'm sure it's probably in there somewhere, but I don't remember what it was. So. Oh, super stuff, I guess. Yeah. The only thing I'm allowed to say about the plot is that at one point, Gurr rides a tiny donkey. He rides a donkey? A tiny one. Oh. <laughs> Sounds amazing. And when can we expect this new movie? They haven't given the release date yet, so I'm sure it'll be out sometime next year, though. Is there anything more you could say about Gurr? Any changes? Any no, he's just, you know, waiting to waiting to do a little bit more to finish up that movie. And then uh, we'll see where we go from there. Simmons also signed this really cool poster for me and my friend Gabby. Thanks, Ricky. Another Long Beach Comic Con has come and gone, but the fun is set to come back on February 16th and 17th, 2019, when the Long Beach Comic Expo comes to town. I hope to see you guys there. This has been Blood Boom Bobby. Did you go to Long Beach Comic Con? Did you have a good time? Please let me know all your thoughts down below in the comments. If you have any ideas for videos, please feel free to email me. My email address is in the description of this video. And you can also leave me ideas in the comments. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you all later. Hey guys, be sure to like this Blood Moon Bobby video if you enjoyed it. Please share this video, subscribe to my channel, and leave a comment. Be sure to ring the notification bell to be notified about my latest upload. Follow me on my social media pages at Blood Moon Bobby to find out about what I'll be covering next and for more of my opinions. Thanks for watching!